Welcome back guys to another video here on the channel. Today we're going to be feeding the timber rattlesnake guys. This is the Crotalus hortus and this is a venomous pit viper that is named to a lot of the southeastern portion of the US and they are an awesome snake to have in captivity. So make sure you check out this awesome app I have on the left side of the screen. You're going to see the home range of the species in particular and you would notice that it's pretty wide and that's due to the fact that there is another name that the snake goes by, the canebrake rattlesnake. And back in the day, they used to have these species split up because there was a northern and southern species with a lot of different colorations and things, but they were not so genetic diverse that they couldn't classify them together. So a lot of people call them canebrakes, some people call them timbers. But another thing about this species is, I believe this is the snake that's on the don't tread on me flag. So if you've seen that, that is a particular route snake that they use for their flag. I just found that out recently, somebody mentioned it to me. Another thing is this is one of the largest species of rattlesnakes that we have here in the state of Georgia, along with the Eastern Diamondback, which is a little bit bigger snake, but still pretty formidable rattlesnake. But I will say this, I know I keep saying but a lot, but they can, interbreed together. They can make what is called a bat wing morph, which is a little bit bigger of a rattlesnake and a good cross in between the two and show a lot of the distinguishing factors as well. So let's go ahead and get started with feeding this snake here. Sometimes, you know, we got to play with them. We got a little frozen thought pinky here for them. Hopefully we can get a good strike. A little bit bigger one for them because they are a pretty decently sized rattlesnake, I would say. See if we can't get, get a good zoom in shot here. Why are we doing this? Whoo, that was a good strike. putting it on his lip now hoping that maybe this will help him and there we go guys there we go guys a good strike and hold on that and then we can enjoy this time lapse but before we do make sure you guys check out the links i got down in the description there's a lot of cool reptile stuff down there from hides mulch and uh, decor lamps light fixtures you name it just stuff that i use every single day and it definitely helps out with the channel and everything because it gives me a little extra cash to do stuff with my reptiles here so everything's appreciated you just gotta go in there and check it out. And you know, if you wanna get it, totally fine. If not, appreciate you just going to look at it anyway. So what's doing time lapse this thing on out and we'll see you when we go feed the other one in just a little minute. All right, so this is the other rattlesnake here. So you can barely see her. She kind of blending in with everything around her. So we'll see if we can't get her to take this here pinky. And you see her tongue is flicking here. Ooh. That was a good strike. Ooh, got the fang stuck in it. But I kind of want her to bite it and hang on to it, you know what I mean?
kind of just like that. And then I'm going to leave that to her. And we're going to let her enjoy the rest of this little meal. And we'll zoom on in some more. 